All right, simplifying trick expression. Do be aware all the information you learn before is counted. So we have always remember sine theta plus cosine square theta equals to one, and tan theta equals to sine theta over cos theta. Also, you need to remember is all those expression with the quadratics uh, exp uh, with the algebraic expression, which is a minus b all square equals to a square plus two a b a minus study. Minus two a b plus b square, a plus b square equals to a square plus two a b plus b square, and a plus b equals to a minus b plus times a minus b equals a square minus b square. These are the information you need for the expansion. So let's get started with an example. So we have five sine square theta plus five cos square theta. So I can see a common factor there. I will take it out. Plus cos square theta, and this is equals to one. So we have five times one equals to five. Nicely simplified. But the, what if I got fraction there? So we're going to go for some fraction here. Um, say for example, we got cos square theta plus one and uh, minus one. That would work better. Over sine theta. So I do not like cosine. I want the sine there. So I have one minus sine square theta minus one over sine theta, and then one minus one is zero. So we have sine negative sine square theta over sine theta. I will cancel the whole thing with one of the sine, and the answer is negative sine theta, and that's how we expand it. Express like all the things. Just assume the cosine thing is one big apple or whatever, so that you can use it for other use. I don't like the apple.